This is the first screencast in a four-part introduction to using Views in Drupal Gardens to make custom listings of content. With Views, you can make lists of taxonomy terms on your site, a monthly archive of content, sortable lists of comments or users, and many other custom listings of all content on your site. Views is a powerful tool. In this screencast, I'll give you an introduction to Views and we'll make a list of headline news. We'll output both a full page and a block like this in the sidebar. First, let's make sure you have the module enabled. Go to Modules and scroll down to Views and select to enable and save configuration. Before we start, let's see, what is Views? Views is a query builder. If we think like a database, it's a little easier to understand. Imagine your database of content a table, listing content, keeping track of the content type and the author. For example, you may want to select just content of the type news, or you may want to list content by a specific author. In this way, you could have a custom list. Views offers many ways to filter, select, and sort content, users, and taxonomy terms. Views can then output different displays of these results. For example, you could list them as a HTML bulleted list, or as a table with sortable columns, or as custom fields with a custom display. You could then output this as a block or a page. Say, for example, you want to place certain content on the sidebar of your site. Your site layout is divided into a number of regions. With views, you can output a block display and control where it is placed. Using the page display, you can make a custom path on your site where the results of your view can be accessed. The page display only affects the content in the main area, though you can change what appears in other regions by using block settings. Let's see how to do this using views. Views are not listed as content items in your content list. You find views under structure when the module is enabled. Click to add new view. Give it a title. In my case, headlines. I can restrict to show only content of news items. By default, views will offer you to create a page. I can leave all the defaults here. Click to create a block. I want a HTML list to show titles as links. I'll change this to 10 items and save an exit. This will automatically take me to my page. Now, I want that block to appear on the sidebar of my site. Go to Structure, Blocks, and listed under Disabled, you can find your new block. Select the region to place it in, and then you can reorder it if you like. And save. Now, I see my headlines appearing on my site. However, I'd like to restrict where this block appears. For example, I don't want this headlines block to appear on my headlines page. Click to configure the block. I'll opt to show this on all pages except those listed and paste in my path headlines. Now I can see it is not showing on the headlines page and I can see it on other pages like this galleries page. To modify your views later, you can click edit view in the gear beside the view or go to Structure, Views to see the views you have. In this screencast, you got a quick introduction to using views to make custom listings of content using a quick wizard. You saw how to make both a page display at a specific path and how to output a block and place it on a specific place on your site. You can watch the other videos in this series to find out more about views. If you have any questions about what you saw, come to the forums in Drupal Gardens.